वेलकम टू द इमरान अकेडमी आई एम डिस्कसिंग विद यू जनरल मैथमेटिक्स ऑफ टेंथ क्लास पंजाब टेक्स्ट बुक बोर्ड लाहौर एंड टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस विद यू यूनिट सिक्स इंट्रोडक्शन टू कोऑर्डिनेट जोमेट्री एंड हेयर वी हैव द डिस्टेंस फार्मूला एप्लीकेशन ऑफ द डिस्टेंस फार्मूला क्वेश्चन नंबर टू से इज फाइन द डिस्टेंस बिटवीन द पॉइंट्स so these are the points four different questions in one question so one question is i have a point 2 comma 1 negative 4 comma 3 so i want to find the distance between these points first of all let me write the distance formula we have a formula for finding the distance between two points the formula says distance between two points can be found by this formula so this is the formula for finding the distance uh i am talking about this particular pair of points so i can write this one as x1 this one as y1 x2 and y2 so the formula says x2 minus x1 whole square so x2 is -4 negative minus uh, x1 is 2 so i'll take the square of this one then y2 minus y1 so in place of y2 i have 3 and in place of y1 i have 1 so i'll take the square of these two terms i'll just take the square of the i'll just take the square root of the whole so negative 4 and negative 2 becomes negative 6 and 3 negative 1 becomes 2 so the square of the negative term produces a positive result So we have square root forty. Square root forty can be simplified. to the pair is like 2 squared and uh, the 2 squared term will go out of the radical sign so this is the distance that's how we can calculate the distance of different points so this was the first point pair of points let's move to the second one negative 1 3 negative 2 negative 1 let's find the distance between these points x1 
x2 minus x1 squared plus y2 minus y1 squared. Just plug in the values and we will find the answer. Changed writing. This is our x1, this is our x, oh, sorry, this is our y1, x2, and y2. <coughs> so, negative 2 minus negative 1 squared plus negative 1 minus 3 squared so we have a negative 2 plus 1 and negative 4 negative 2 plus 1 is negative 1 squared plus negative 4 squared so it is 1 plus 16 so we have 17 S square root 17 and this is the distance for the given pair of points straightforward formula no worries just plug in the values and you will get the answer. Let us move to the next one. This okay. So, what is the next question? 7, comma, negative 2, and then negative 2, comma, so what would be the distance between these two points just use the formula x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square so I can write it as x1, I can write it as y1, x2, y2. So, uh, x2 minus x1 squared plus y2 minus y1 squared. So it becomes a negative 9 squared and 2 plus 3 squared. And it is negative 9 squared plus 5 squared. which is 9 squared is 81 and 5 squared is 25 so it is 80 plus 20 100 106 so this is the distance we can just simplify this one further if we like but I think it's enough 
you can use the calculator to simplify this one let's move to the next one fourth part here we have a comma negative b and b comma negative a so just find the distance between these two points so the distance again is x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square so we have x1 here x2 here y1 here and y2 here So what can we do x2 minus x1 that is b minus a squared plus y2 minus y1 y2 is negative a negative minus negative b squared <coughs> so it is b minus a whole squared and again negative uh, minus minus plus so it is b minus a again so you can write it as b minus a whole square so uh, same terms we can write it as 2 times b minus a whole square in the square root sign so uh, square root 2 will remain in the uh, 2 will remain in the square root sign and b minus a will come out because this uh, square and square root will cancel so this is the final answer for the distance of these points so that's how we can apply the formula and find the distance and that's it uh, for today thanks for watching please do like share and subscribe the Imran Academy for more lectures in the future till the next lecture it's goodbye